friends. It's been a wild, wild travel day, but we have made it to New York for my first ever New York Fashion Week. I have wanted to go to New York Fashion Week for so long and finally here I am. My mom didn't sleep and I have been up since 2.30 a.m. I probably got two hours of sleep, but like a light sleep. It is now 3.45 in the afternoon. So it's already been a 12 hour day for us, plus plus. And not a great one. Oh my goodness, it was crazy. It's been wacky. Crazy, every single step. Every been... step of the way has been a problem. All we could do is laugh. It's behind us now. So you might have watched this vlog where I came to New York and I brought a stylist to the set of the uh, Daily Show with Trevor Noah. Her name is Taylor. She is absolutely fabulous. And I met her at Nordstrom after running in and out of like all these different stores trying to find an outfit for the show. She stumbled upon us, fell into our lap and helped make that masterpiece of an outfit. That is this. She invited me through Nordstrom to come back for New York Fashion Week. So Nordstrom isn't paying me. This isn't like a content creator thing. I, there's no, I don't have to make content. I just obviously want to share this cool experience with you guys. Um, they just let their um, stylists pick a couple of their clients to like bring in for New York Fashion Week. So they've put me up in this beautiful hotel near the store um and apparently there's only one nordstrom in new york i believe uh, i think there's two but oh, there's the, two i think so and it's I'm, like but apparently this one is like brand new yeah like they just got like a big one so i think that's probably why they're doing this yeah. i don't know but i'm happy she picked me and excited to be here anyways i've got tons of stuff that i'm doing it's so funny because i didn't know what shows i was going to go to and generally you're supposed to kind of try to wear the clothes of like show that you're going to of the designer, but I didn't know what shows I was going to. So I brought like all the designer clothes I own, which honestly isn't very much. Put in a little suitcase and Kim brought it with me. I left two things, two singular things. My Kalina Strata pants, these ones, and my Stella McCartney boots, these ones. Well, what shows do you think I'm going to friends? Obviously God would send me to Kalina Strata and Stella McCartney, which I'm not complaining. I'm very excited because obviously I love both of those designers. I own a piece from each of them, but of course it's just like that happens to be the singular items that I own that are a designer that I did not bring. So I am about to go run off to Nordstrom. It's like a six minute walk from the hotel. It'll be a great way for Sir Elton John to get a good walk in. And he loves indoor work. Like the boy thrives in indoor environments. So he loves to shop bless him and so we're gonna go do a little shopping and i want to show you what i'm wearing that's just like what i wore on the plane but i think it's super cute hey elton john you want to show your outfit too you're looking snazzy in your black fluff um so i am wearing these nike airs that i got at asos oh and this nordstrom event is in collaboration with asos um so i got these nikes at asos I have these Pleat Please Isamiyaki pants, which are my obsession, and I wear them way too much. And then I have it paired with this like fluffy, fuzzy, bright fuchsia crop top cardigan combo. Fuchsia is the color of fall. I know it like, doesn't seem like it, but I'm telling you this year, fuchsia and green. Green will continue to be big this fall, but fuchsia is big this fall. And where's the purse I had it paired with? Super cute. And it goes like perfectly with this look. Oh, and the cardigan and tank are from Aritzia, if I didn't mention. So this is just my airplane fit. So we got to the airport at 4 a.m. It was so busy. Then we got our flight canceled and we got pushed back from a 7 a.m. flight to a 9.30 a.m. flight. And we had to get there three hours early because we had to go through the border and everything. And because my mom and I were on like a bit of a unique visa, Sometimes it can take a while to get through, but a guy was so nice today. Then the like we were delayed on the tarmac, and then when we got here, the tarmac the... was like half an hour delay. Yeah, yeah. And then oh, they took our baggage, our carry-ons. They, they were supposed to. They yeah. took it, and then there was a delay getting them off the plane because the thing that transports them <laughs> from below to above was Broke. broken. And then. Uh, two taxis, two New York taxis denied me with my guide dog, and I am telling you, it got nasty, okay? And I had these wonderful men fighting on my behalf, okay, um, who worked at the airport. This was their job, but they were fighting. They were going to bat for me. Um, they were so kind, so understanding. They knew the law. They understood that this was my guide dog. 
um, and they were fighting for me. And it was a black man and a brown man. And then all of a sudden, the second taxi, second taxi to de deny me starts a racist fight with these two people, which was horrific to witness. I was just like, so you're ableist and racist, got it, check, not, not okay. They were just like so kind. They kicked both of those taxis out. They wouldn't fill them with other people. They were like, no, if you're not gonna take her, you're not taking anybody at the airport, leave. So they made them both leave and it was a mess. It was really bad. There was yelling. It got really, really bad. Um, really bad. We took like probably the worst, um, but we took all of their information and we are gonna call and complain. And I'm so appreciative to those two men that like were fighting for me and on my side, especially because they ended up putting themselves in the line of fire for me. So a very like angels, such wonderful people. So then we finally got a taxi. We thought we were gonna be three hours early and have time to get ready for my meeting. We did not, okay? We were half an hour, we were 15 minutes late for my lunch meeting. So I'm really glad I decided last minute to put makeup on this morning before the flight and a cute outfit because um, I had to go straight to my meeting. And now, we're off to shop. We have made it to Nordstrom. The amazing Taylor has pulled so many pink things. It's true. So many glittery things. So many cartoony fun things to try. I'm like dying. This might be the best dressing room anyone's ever pulled for me. It's a Molly room. It's the most it's a Molly, Molly room. I think anyone's ever pulled. For me. <laughs> Don't you think? Mom? I mean, yeah. yeah. No, it's, it's truly, truly, truly. So pink. This is a stream I'm at New York Fashion Week, you uh -huh. guys. It's chain mail and what what did you like fun confetti? It feels like confetti. Yeah. Like it feels like confetti, but it's like it's just a party. It's and look at me. Dress. Every nobody could miss me. No one will miss you. It's so good. Even the blind folk will find me. Even the blind folk. <laughs> oh my god. Because the sound, right? Exactly. It's awesome. I can't wait to start trying on. Thank you so, so many much. good things. Yes, 100%. Okay, we're going to have some This has fun. gloves. <gasps> I know, I know. We're going to have to gloves. play with it. Yes, yes. Ooh. Oh, it has. oh, that's mm -hmm. the one, that's yes. That's the one that has the yes. gloves. The Richard Quinn. Oh, you're too good, Taylor. Listen. Oh, this is dangerous thing. <laughs> that's oh, the it's, point. It's <laughs> <laughs> Look at this bag. Wait, oh, it's a little that, frog. Oh my it's Kalina Strata. <laughs> it's a pink frog. Mom, it's Kalina Strata. <laughs> that is incredible. I know. <laughs> Mom, she's real good. Hey, you know what? We were under budget by uh -huh. quite a lot for my outfit we got for Ooh, yeah. the Daily Show. Oh, yeah. So we'll just make up the rest of the budget. It's true. <laughs> Do you have the glitter bottle loafers? I don't. I just think of you when I see those two. I'm like, I that's, know. That's a shoe for Molly, too. It is a Molly shoe. Trust me, every you, time I see I know, them, you've I thought about that, that right? Yes. Yeah. You really might need that. That's oh, he thinks it's really cute. That's so cute. He thinks it's a toy. Oh, it's, that's what it is. He thinks it's he a thinks toy. He thinks it's for Elton. You want to carry your poop and bag in? Unbelievably cute. Okay, cush your booty. Cush your booty. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Okay, I'll be right back. Cush your booty, bon chien. So good. Oh, also, you guys, she's sustainable. She's <laughs> reusable. Reduce, reuse, recycle. I'm a sustainability queen with my glittery water bottle. You guys. These are also Kalina Strata, who I, as I've said earlier, love. I know. It's Delish. gorgeous. It's so good. Okay. It's we... so, it's so good. good. It's like, you're going to be different. You're going to be... lean in. Yeah. You know, just lean into being yes. different. Why try to blend in? You think I'm blending in with this pooch? <laughs> nah, we stand it out, Elton. That's good. Do you have things? Do you have so, a, well, uh, I have a, like, I have a second harness, oh, and cool. I think we just need to take it to, like, a bling smith. Yes. You know what I mean? And have them fully bling out oh, my second great. harness. What a great right? idea, yes. Right? So that way, for events, I have like, a full bling harness. This on his harness, like. Yeah. That's what yeah. I'm saying? Like, we do yes. a full crystal designer. Yes. Okay. Design. Yes. Any of my followers, if you guys are bling artists or know somebody who does high-quality bling that would last on a leather harness, Okay, let me know because we need to collaborate on a sparkle harness. That's right. We are well aware this is not for everybody, but I'm not for everybody. And that's my charm, <laughs> I'd like to think. Um, and like, look, New York Fashion Week is about like experimenting and having fun and being a little bit weird. Who right. wants to be yes. like, that's right. who wants to be not weird at New York Fashion Week? It's true. This is the time to be weird. So this top is a long sleeve mock neck, just fun, cartoony. Yes. Colorful. And it has an eye. 
it's the vibe. It's the vibe. And then we put it with this skirt, which does have a matching cardigan, and I am trying next. I've tried on this brand before. What's the brand for both of these? This is Ekas Lada. This is a different, this is a different brand. Yes. And both of these you could mix and match with so many other pieces, but I am going to try it on with like the matching cardigan. Just do it. Just to do a more cohesive look. Yeah. We're playing around. We're having fun. <laughs> Nobody is missing me. Also, it's freezing. It was like I walked into a refrigerator. I mean, it's made of metal, okay? It was so cold, my poor nips weren't ready. It was <laughs> awful. But I warmed up, you know? <laughs> From all the dancing it deserves, you know? Yeah. It, like, it needs to be danced in. Absolutely. Mm. Begging for it. <laughs> <laughs> He's begging for it. Hello. She has arrived in Richard Quinn. This is fabulous. Okay, I think like, wait, where are you, mom? Am I looking the right way? <laughs> yeah, no, here, I'm over here. Yes. <laughs> Flying around, moment. Um, I'm too excited, so when I spun, I got lost. Um, Don't fall off. This is, would you call it a neon pink, mom? Yes. It's neon pink, like a neoprene swimsuit material, and it is like all one. So the gloves are attached to the dress, which is ruched all down the middle, little necktie around the neck situation this is freaking so cool i'm feeling myself i feel confident i would have worn this on the daily show with trevor noah if it had been in because this is the exact store i shopped at and you guys know i did the glove moment so i think the glove moment is like molly burke 2022 come love on it. Love when my mom it, looked it. at it she like was very underwhelmed. Like her reaction <laughs> was very under, and I was confused because I was like, I feel fabulous. So what's this? What's no, I love here? it. Like it, it's stunning. But she like somehow missed the gloves. <laughs> <laughs> it was the gloves. It's all about the gloves. Because the, without the gloves, it's me. I don't know. You're like Spider Man or something in pink. <laughs> I feel like a superhero. It's or gorgeous. maybe a super villain. Is this my? So cute. Uh, so it's the first day, full day of New York Fashion Week. I look very glamorous. I know. I had my breakfast, then I just had a blind girl moment where I brushed my teeth and everything, came and sat on the bed. Yogurt on the butt. Oh. All right, so I just got my hair done at the dry bar um, for day one, and I'm here at the Chanel makeup counter at Nordstrom, and Oscar is going to be making my face look way prettier than it currently does. So I'm a McCartney lunch, and they're having some models come out in different clothes, and I really want to touch it. It's not a like sure, like stuff. It sounds so pretty. Inlay. There's a knit inlay in it. This nipple is made. Knit inlay. Beautiful. Oh, this is really cute. Okay, so I'm gonna Oh, it's made out of recycled material. I absolutely adore that. By the way, the boots that everyone's obsessed with of mine, these ones, they're so much art. How much is this? So snuggly. It's like, like me and Elton John would be competing. Absolutely horrible vlogging today, but I went to my first ever runway show. It was Clean Estrada, which is one of my absolute favorite brands. Sustainable, based in New York. She's like so great at using diverse models. She uses just real people, real people, like disabled models, all ages, all gender identities, ethnicities. Like it's amazing. One of the models is in a wheelchair. We love to see it. And this is the fit that I'm wearing. I just have my spot of sunnies popped on my head. It's amazing, obviously. And, and very comfortable. Very comfortable. Okay, give us the rundown. So this gorgeous dress is from Richard Quinn. Um, amazing. Obviously the glove is attached. We love that. This it's a water sleeve that doesn't end. <laughs> the water bottle is clearly Colleen Estrada, none other than gorgeous. Colina X Melissa, and it is from Recycle Plastics and Cane Sugar, and they smell sweet, right? They literally smell sweet. It's crazy. We love that. We put all this energy and effort and money into this outfit, and then we show up and he still does no He did nothing. He just has his typical fur. He just has his typical fur. He's just being. And he's like, <laughs> Where are we? I'm Lily. I'm the president of our 13. Okay. So now. So this is like such an amazing Japanese flannel, and it's all bleached down. So each piece will be super like regular and unique. Uh, 
I love this so much. I feel like you can style this a million ways. Like throw a turtleneck under it with like tights and some booties, or just do it on its own with like some knee high socks and sneakers. Like there's so many ways you could style this, right? Totally. Like, yeah, I agree. Have a lot of fun with 100%. It. Wear it open. With yeah. like a cute little bandeau. Totally. And, you know, like it's I've just so denim. Cool, right? I would yeah, unbutton I it to say, there. Do denim. Do some mm-hmm. denim with a little bralette. Yeah. And like you've gotta check out the shoes because they're Those so, so comfy and amazing and they're like Wait, made in shoes? Italy. Yeah. yeah. These oh, are made in Italy. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh my god, I'd like to take you to the shoe wall. Oh my god, the shoe wall. Yeah, we should go. There's that shoe wall. Shoes Oh my god. Oh we're going to the shoe wall. Oh look. Italy. <laughs> <laughs> they are amazing. There we go. So yeah. comfortable, and they give you the height yeah. without. Which you can tell I mean. I also I mean. I mean, we're height. sisters now. <laughs> Mom, they are beautiful. Those are fabulous. They are fabulous, yeah. and they come in so many yeah. amazing colors. Like this is a green one. There's pink ones. Okay, these are really amazing. Oh. This is called the Rogue. It's again made in Italy in a very artisanal factory in Tuscany, and they're like so cool. They're you get so the good. Yeah. I like these ones down here. Like there's like braille on them. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the corgi as well. Oh, I know. Oh, amazing oh. with the spikes. Yes. Like don't hurt yourself. Yes, no. seriously. They are sharp. Yeah. These are so fun. anything pink. Anything. Oh, there it is. There's a the pink. We found them. So this is the Kurt pink version. <laughs> A pink version. We love. Very nice. Love Very them. nice. Yeah, they're amazing. So this is yeah. the single cell, but they're still taller. Than oh, they're the beautiful normal. with the flowers. I mean, beautiful with the beautiful. Molly with flowers. flowers. I mean, they're beautiful. And yeah. these two, aren't those amazing? Love. Like all the buckles up it? Do you like the shoes that far? This is Mama, Mama that's V. You. That's right. Mama's yeah. over 60 now. She's like, shit happens. Like underwear that say, like, you know. Shit happens. No, F. Like, oh, well, shit happens. <laughs> Should be on the underwear, though. I don't know that we're going I there. So maybe. Like, yeah, it's more like. Oh, you no, did poop on the way here. <laughs> shit did happen on the way here. <laughs> did. Poor Elton. On the streets of New York. He's a gorgeous boy. He's he a is thank boy. you. He says, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Leon Hotel. Yay, okay, tell is, us the story, Molly. Yes, that is the hotel I stayed in in Tribeca. Where are you? I can't what? find you. Hi. <laughs> I can't find you. Is that Molly? Is yes. that too bright? I think I got her. Come on, I'm That's Leon. good, that's good. You want that on? No, light on. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Um, so that is the hotel I stayed at when I came to Tribeca to film with Casey Neistat. Isn't that crazy? Good memories. I love that. Now we're in the back of the car on our way to attempt to finagle our way into the Fendi show. Okay, so we're grabbing a drink after the R13 thing and going to another R13 thing. So we found this just like little bar we stumbled upon for a little cocktail moment. A pink drink for a pink gal. Cheers. 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 Cheers.
guy does more in my life. Yeah. I was like, if you would like to bet my guy dog, I will take the damn hard to stop and you can, you can go to town, okay? But he didn't. He didn't give a shit. Yeah, okay. They were smart. Oh, they seem very smart. They're okay. most disinterested. Here, Molly. <laughs> we're waiting for the Uber. <laughs> my glasses fall off my face. They get scuffed. These are expensive. These are Prada. They are probably the, the most I've ever spent on sunglasses in my life. I dropped them. Second time wearing them. Scuffed. They're like, it's fine. Sorry, Actually. people. They're looking at them. They, I can't even see it. I'm like, I can feel it. <laughs> okay, these brow ridden fingers, they can feel it. I, I grab them and I put them back on my face like this. <laughs> it looks amazing. And, uh, smart designers. For those who also can't see, they are upside down. <laughs> It was an accident, I but we're going with it. I think some people are gonna read it and be like, that's that's it. That's good. That's, that's, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. No, I just bought none. these. They were so Nothing. expensive. No, they are. I can just see any scum. I didn't see any. There's no. a tiny little bit here. Teeny tiny. I know I saw I saw teeny tiny. I don't know through the gloves how you feel about Those it. Those sensitive fingers feel too much. The puppy energy has to be. That's right. I wanna go to sleep. This is what he wants to do. Hey! Hey! Elton? He's still. We've known each other six weeks. Six weeks? Hey! It's not a lot. Enough. Push me. <laughs> so You're still baby. You're still baby. So cute. Yeah, you think so. Glad you think so. Push me. Don't mind me not having a voice, typical. Anytime Molly goes to an event, she loses her voice. It's the last day, I'm headed home. I was supposed to go to another show, but like every street in New York is shut down today. Traffic was not our friend. So we were like, you know what, forget it. We're not doing it. So I'm wearing my incredible sax pot jacket, sax pots jacket to the airport with like a fanny pack. It's a, a real, it's a look. It's a look. It's a look. It looks good though. But I wanted to show you this before we leave. Um, when I first got here, I was like, wow, this is the least accessible elevator I've ever seen. Because it's touch screen, you touch which floor you're going to, it visually shows you which elevator to wait for, um, and that's that. But then I realized down here, there's a tactile button, has three dots on it, and look. You have selected the accessibility mode of operation. Press button when you hear the desired floor, or touch the screen to cancel. Lobby, going to floor, lobby, take elevator, six, which plays, at arrival. So each elevator gives a different sound and they play you the sound so you know which sound to listen for. This is like proof that you can make something modern and cool and sleek while also being fully accessible. It's incredible. So I have been home from New York Fashion Week for about a month now. Full disclosure, all of the videos you'll be seeing for the next little while were pre-filmed and I'm uploading them all out of order, like just in a different order the videos should still make sense to you. But I've just like selected a specific order. Um, so like this video was filmed after some of the next few videos. Anyways. Um, one thing is consistent throughout all of the videos since June, and that is that I'm struggling with my voice. I do have a vocal cord injury right now. I am working on it, um, and actually since getting back from New York, I canceled a lot of work engagements, and I've just been focusing on my health and rebuilding because I burnt out and I pushed myself too hard. I've been through a lot this year, continuing to go through some challenges, and at the end of the year, I do plan to sit down and tell you about everything that's been going on, but I'm still a little in the thick of it. I'm on the better end of it, but I'm just trying to heal right now. So that's what's up. Just gonna eat some Thai food, bring my spin drift, and enjoy my Sunday. And I hope all of you are enjoying your Tuesday or whatever day you're watching this video. And thank you for being such a great support system for me. Going to New York Fashion Week was such a dream come true for me. And if I never get to go to another fashion week, I can say I've been to one. And like little, little girl Molly used to sit and design dresses at eight years old and a little picture book would be um, 
screaming and crying and jumping up and down right now for me. So thank you guys because I only get opportunities like this because you all support me. So yeah, that's all. And until next time, you can click over here to see my review of ASOS or you can click over here to see my furniture shopping experience.